12 AMD RX 570s on Asus Z270A. Thanks to Robert for providing me with this video footage so that I could show everybody 12 GPUs on a Z270A Asus motherboard. 12 GPU mining rig using one motherboard and simple mining OS. This is the motherboard. Asus Prime Z270A. Processor I'm using is an Intel Celeron 3930. The socket on this board is 1151. I'm using only one stick of RAM, 8 gig, DDR4, a GPU, a Sapphire Nitro Plus, Radeon, RX 570, 4 gig, overclocked edition. These are the cards. Eight pin connector and six pin. I only provide power to the eight pin connector. No issue whatsoever. It's nice about these cards. They come with the bio switch. I make all my modifications in silent mode, which is on this side of the card. And this is the rig. And I decided to build a rack instead of building individual rigs. And I'll give you guys a closer shot here. All 12 running on one board. Now, obviously, this is only doable if you use one of these uh, PCIe expansion cards. This is a 1 to 4. And we'll try to squeeze in here. So we're using every PCIe slot on this board. And there we go. And of course, we are also using these M.2 sockets with these adapters. So we're using this one here and the second one right there. And of course, the expansion card. You guys a closer shot of this one. Plug in four GPUs in here. It needs power. I'm using a Molex to power this card and it comes with a USB cable which connects to one of your PCIe slots. I am connecting it to the second PCIe x16. Haven't had any issues. Um, this thing is awesome. Didn't have any issue whatsoever. Um, out of the box, plugged them all in, um, started up and no issue whatsoever. I was really surprised. I thought I would have some issues. I thought I would only be able to use maybe two or three. I didn't think all four would work, but uh, uh, to my surprise, it did. Um, so, right, so uh, super easy. This one here and both of these uh, M.2 adapters, I got them from Cryptomine. You can check them out on uh, YouTube or on his website. Uh, you can get these from his site at cryptomine.com uh, super simple as I said and so this entire rig um, is powered by two 1000 watt EVGA G2's that's the second right there and they are hooked up with uh, a dual PSU adapter and the main one is powering the board one of the M.2 sockets and this uh, expansion card it is uh, the main one is also powering six gpus including um, the risers and the eight pin connectors i'll show you guys i'm only using the eight pin i'm not using both you don't have, you don't have to use both and the cards work just fine and the second power supply is, uh, of course, uh, powering the rest um, uh, of the rig. So six cards, including the risers and the 8-pin connectors up top. The main power supply is drawing about 880 watts from the wall. The second power supply is drawing about 840 watts from the wall 
So, uh, like I said, I'm using Simple Mining OS. I'm sort of new to it, but uh, it's uh, pretty, uh, pretty simple. Uh, no pun intended, as the name implies. It's uh, Simple Mining, so I uh, didn't have any issues setting it up. And here's the miner. I'm using Claymore's miner. I believe this is Claymore 9.7, if I'm not mistaken, maybe maybe 9.5. And I'm getting around 315.6 mega hash per sec um, on uh, Ethereum. Each card is right now doing around 26.3. In Windows, when I was modding these cards, I was able to get these uh, up to anywhere between 27 and 28. And they were very stable, uh, drawing... Um, around 90 watts each um, yep now my mods are um, the GPU core I down clocked it to 1150 and the memory overclocked to 2000 and uh, the memory straps on this is the 1500 copied over 1625 I believe and over 1750 and 2000 on both sets and uh, I was able to get around uh, 27, between 27 and 28 using Windows 10. I haven't uh, played around too much in Simple Mining OS, but if I'm able to get these up to 27 uh, uh, using Simple Mining OS, then that would be great. Because uh, right now I'm only getting 26.3 out of each card, which is you know still decent, 315.6 uh, mega hash per sec um, on only one board. I'm not going to complain, it's, uh, it's freaking awesome. If you're able to get one of these, they're, they're fairly inexpensive and you're able to get uh, another, uh, another basically three cards uh, on this board. So I hope this was helpful, I'll give you guys one last shot, there you go, 12 GPUs, one board. This is a follow-up to the 12 GPU mining rig. It's been running for a few hours now without any issues. You can see 12 GPUs still captured here. 315.5, so 315.6 mega hash per sec using Claymore's miner, mining Ethereum. And this screen is connected to one of the GPUs. It displays the miner only. You need to log on to uh, simplemining.net and go through your dashboard to see uh, to see your rig. So right there, that shows you the name of your rig, the status, the console, and what you're uh, what you're hashing right there. Here's the uh, temperatures and and fan. Notice how cool they are. The heatsink on these cards is very good. I definitely recommend using these cards. Um, notice that in, in this box it does display 12 GPUs while in this box it only displays 10. Not sure what the 7 is for. I am still fairly new to using Simple Mining OS. Maybe I'm missing something but uh, it only seems to be displaying 10 instead of 12. We'll open up the console. It is kind of hard to read. I really do wish it was uh, color coded like this. But you can still, with uh, if you pay careful attention, you can still find what your hash rate is, temperatures, and all that. I hope this helps. So I'd like to thank Robert again for sharing this with us all. And we'll have to wait and see if he's able to get 15 cards working with another 1-4 extender. I hope you liked the video. I hope it helped. And thanks for watching.